Hello and welcome to Kursky.com. In this video, we will show you how to take measurements for the sari blouse. All you will need is a measuring tape and maybe a book and a pen to note down the measurements. Now, all the measurements we note down will be in inches and we recommend you to do the same. My team here will help you along the measurement process. So, let's get started. We first begin with the measurement of number one, the blouse length. So you take the measurement from the highest point of the shoulder up to the desired length of the blouse. Next, number 2, the waist. You usually measure the waist where the blouse length ends, so you measure around your waist. Next, number 3, the chest. So you just wrap the measuring tape across the chest or bust area to get your exact chest measurements. Next, number 4, the armhole. So you just take the measurement around the armhole. Now when you take the measurement, remember to move your arm around a bit to see if it's flexible and not restricted. Next, number 5, the sleeve length. So for the accurate arm measurements, you should start from the end of your shoulder or to be precise, where your arm starts right here up till the desired length. Next, number 6, the sleeve round, which is where your sleeve ends. So if you're looking into stitching a 3 4 sleeve, then you will wrap the measuring tape around the forearm where your sleeve length ends. Now one thing you should remember while taking this measurement is to always leave an inch loose after you measure because if you take the exact measurement, you may have trouble getting your whole hand into the sleeve while wearing the outfit. Next, number 7, the front neckline which starts from the highest point of the shoulder till the desired neck depth. Next, Number 8. The front cross. The front cross measurement in simple terms is the distance between one armpit to the other. Next, number 9. The dot point. The dot point measurement is the highest point of the shoulder to the dot point. The dot point would be your apex. So you take two dot point measurements. One would be from the shoulder to your apex and the other would be from apex to apex. Next, number 10, the shoulder. We measure the shoulder distance from one shoulder line to the other shoulder line. Next, number 11, the back neckline. We measure the back neckline from the highest point of your shoulder to your desired neck depth, but on the back. Finally, number 12, the back cross. We will be taking the distance from one armpit to the other, but on your back. Thank you for tuning in. We hope this video helped you. If you have any queries that have not been answered in this video, you can always email our customer support team at support at